Brown back here. It's um, August 29th uh, here. It's about noon time here in at the Jersey Shore, Eastern Standard Time. And this morning, I'm going to say around 9 a.m., maybe around when I first saw that the, the DJI Neo has finally been acknowledged by DJI officially. We didn't, we not, as of noon, we haven't got an email from DJI yet as a teaser, but the teaser showed up on DJI's um, you know, store app. Uh, what, what's the little, yeah, the store app, is that what you call it, uh, you know, on the phone where, you, you know, you buy stuff out of it, but the shopping app, store app, whatever the official title for that app is, but, you know, they had a little teaser right when you started the app up. It said, uh, the future takes shape. Uh, September 5th, 2024 at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And they showed like a little, you know, picture of the uh, kind of the top and side of the Neo uh, where you could see the um, the buttons on the top that you use to uh, automate the, um, you know, kind of the, uh, the, the quick shot modes like, you know, orbits and dronies and so on like that. And of course you could voice control it on this drone according to the leaks and, and rumors. And you do see the Neo name on the side of the drone. Usually DJI, they usually don't put the name in, in a lot of their teaser leaks for their drones. So this one's a little bit different uh, as far as that's concerned. But uh, again, I can't find this kind of any place else. I haven't done an exhaustive search, but you know, I don't find it mentioned. You don't, if you go to DJI's regular website, you don't see the Neo mentioned. You don't see it on their YouTube page page or you know I can't find in, in, in most of their social media again I haven't scrounged everything but that uh, so it's kind of hard to find this teaser at this point we're trying to spread around as much as possible so September 5th is a Thursday it's exactly a week from today um, that'll be the official launch uh, Jasper Ellens has leaked out almost all the details uh, of the drone from kind of an Australian you know, store or website or whatever more, more than a week ago. Now we covered it like, um, you know, um, basically, uh, you know, tooth and nail on drone nation, uh, not this show, but the show before, uh, I said the 29th, so maybe the 22nd went down every feature, but kind of almost everything's known except for the exact pricing for various countries, you know, mostly, uh, you know, focused on the U.S. on this channel here, but, uh, you know, the, uh, the exact pricing for the U.S. or any country, really, uh, we've seen that Australian say two ninety nine. We've heard three twenty nine for a long time for the U.S. And we think the 29, they used to say that was for the fly more, uh, uh bundle, whatever. So, uh, and a big thing is we, a lot of people want to know if, um, you know, if you'll be able to buy just the drone when it releases, because obviously if you just want it as a selfie drone, come out of the palm, you yeah, maybe don't want all the controllers and things like that. And for people that do want a lot of control, um, because it's also, it's, you know, uh, I'm, I'm still going to say rumored because we haven't heard it from DJI, but they'll work with, um, you know, the DJI RCN2 controller, the, um, uh, the DJI motion controller for, you know, for the FPV drones, the Godless 3. So a lot of people that may buy, you know, the deal already have all the various controllers that it works with. So all you really need is a drone and a battery. Well, the flight time is only rumored to be around 18 minutes on this and so maybe you need a couple of batteries, but you know, um, you know, a lot of people don't want to spend a lot of money just, you know, collecting uh, controllers they already have. So if they release a kind of a drone only bundle on day one, I don't mean six months from now or three months from now, whatever day one, a drone only, uh, that'll make a lot of few folks in the community happy. So, um, yeah, um, that's all I really have right now. Um, you know, as far as drone nation is concerned, we'll probably do like a, um, you know, at the live show, um, live launch party next Thursday morning, you know, kind of go over all the pricing, availability, specs, and so on, opinions, uh, you know, from, from what we see, you know, from the confirmed specs that day. And of course, that'll be the day where you watch all your videos from the, um, you know, all the YouTube influencers who have got it early, so on. So it'll be a very busy day. And this has been a drone. A lot of people have been talking about it. A lot of people are really looking forward to this drone. A lot of people, you know, think, ah, it's just kind of a toy. You know, let's get this thing released so we can get to the drones. We really want the Air 3S and the Mavic 4. So whatever side of the conversation you're on, uh, next Thursday is still going to be, you know, kind of an interesting day. So, um, yeah. So um, that's it. And next week's going to be a big week, too. Um, not next week, but the... The, the, actually, not this coming Monday, which would be Moral Day or Labor Day, sorry, but the following Monday will be 
um, the day Apple launches their new iPhones on the 9th, they call it Glow, Glowing Events has a name. So um, that'll be a big day too with the new iPhones uh, you know, coming out. So yeah, a lot, a lot of tech coming soon. And, and the GoPro Hero 13 is rumored to be coming out on September 16th. So you got the, you got the 5th, the 9th, and the 16th to put in your calendar for big tech launches. So yeah. Um, uh, we probably we won't probably won't have a, a, a real show Monday night for Drone Nation because it is the Labor Day holiday. Uh, a lot of us have barbecues and you know and the summer events to go to that day. So it probably won't be an official show that night. But uh, you know, hopefully we we will have a lunch party a couple of days later the fifth for the new DJI Neo. Okay, thanks for watching. And at some point in this video, I, I, I I'm going to throw that um, screenshot in uh, the teaser from DJI's store app or whatever. So, some, some, uh, hopefully by this point you've already seen that little overlay uh, of the, um, you know, the little, the little teaser there, and hopefully it becomes more widespread. You know, I'm guessing they'll email everybody eventually, maybe later on today or going into next week. So, okay, thanks for watching, folks. It's a short one today, and uh, we'll be back as we get more information. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.